Your combination boiler directly heats both radiator water and hot water from the taps, removing the need for a hot water storage tank. The hot water is heated directly when you open any hot tap in the system. If your boiler is not powered on, check the switch to the side is turned on. You can set your boiler to off, hot water only, or radiator water and hot water. We recommend you set your radiator water to the eco setting, but during the winter season, you may want to set to maximum as your incoming mains will be colder, so you will need to heat the water more. You can set the hot water to max, but if you have young children in the house who have access to the sinks, you may want to limit this to 40 degrees, which is the same setting as the baths. You can check the pressure of your boiler by looking at the gauge. The pressure should be between the green marks. If you need to repressurize the boiler, turn the blue valves on the underside of the boiler on. Please remember, if the valve is going with the flow of water or gas, then it is turned on. And if it is at a right angle to the flow, then it is turned off. Turn both blue valves on and you will see the pressure gauge rise. When it has reached the desired pressure, turn both the blue valves off. Should a fault develop with your boiler, it will enter a safety lockout mode and fault code information will be generated on the screen. Please check your user manual for a list of fault codes and actions required. If you need to restart your boiler, press the restart button and the boiler will repeat its ignition sequence. If the boiler fails to start in the first 12 months, please contact customer care or after 12 months, contact a gas safe registered engineer or an IE registered gas installer. You must register your boiler within 30 days of legal completion to validate your guarantee. And to maintain this, it will require annual servicing and you should employ a gas safe registered engineer to perform this. For more information about your boiler, please consult your user manual.